Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Tuesday, March 29th, 2022 episode of the new Fantasy Basketball Daily Injury Report. In this video, I will give you all the latest information on injured players and their backups so that you could be the first manager in your league to make the best additions to your starting roster every day. Before I begin, if you would like to read the transcript of this video as it's playing, please click on the description below and follow along. In today's injury report, the Atlanta Hawks' DeAndre Hunter was out for tonight's game versus the Pacers with a sore right knee. Bogdan Bogdanovich started in his place and posted 28 minutes, 5 threes, 29 points, and 5 rebounds. Bogdanovich is a reserve player who is mostly owned, so... If he's on your bench, slot him in. Boston Celtics, Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, Al Horford, and Robert Williams were all ruled out of last night's game versus the Raptors. Brown has right knee tendinopathy. Tatum has right patella tendinopathy. Horford has personal issues. And Williams has a torn meniscus in his left knee. Brown and Tatum might not be out long, but Horford may be out the rest of the season, and Williams will be out several weeks. Beneficiaries will be the entire bench, namely Grant Williams, Derek White, Daniel Tice, Aaron Naismith, and Peyton Pritchard. In Sunday's game, Williams posted 28 minutes, 1-3, 7 points, and 3 rebounds. White posted 30 minutes, 2 threes, 15 points, 2 rebounds, 6 assists, and 1 steal. Tice posted 18 minutes, 4 points, 6 rebounds, 1 steal, and 1 block. Naismith posted 16 minutes. 6 points, 4 rebounds, 1 assist, and 1 steal. Pritchard posted 21 minutes, 3 threes, 11 points, 2 rebounds, and 5 assists. If you are in need of a replacement for Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, Al Orford, or Robert Williams, Grant Williams, Derek White, Daniel Tice, Aaron Naismith, and Peyton Pritchard are all expected to play big minutes. Detroit Pistons' Jeremy Grant has been ruled out for the rest of the season with a left calf strain. Marvin Bagley will be his main beneficiary. In Sunday's game, Bagley posted 35 minutes, 1-3, 27 points, 7 rebounds, and 1 block. If you are in need of a replacement for Jeremy Grant, Marvin Bagley is over half-owned in all fantasy leagues. Indiana Pacers O'Shea Brissett was ruled out of last night's game versus the Hawks with a sore back. Jalen Smith started in his place and posted 22 minutes, 1-3, one 9 points, 6 rebounds, and 1 block. If O'Shea Brissett is still out for Wednesday's game, Jalen Smith should draw another start. Oklahoma City Thunder. Darius Baisley will miss the rest of the season with a non-displaced tibial plateau fracture in his right knee. Aaron Wiggins and Alexei Pokazewski will be the beneficiaries. In Saturday's game, Wiggins posted 30 minutes, 1-3, 10 points, 2 rebounds, and 3 assists. Pokazewski posted 35 minutes, 2 threes, 17 points, 5 rebounds, 5 assists, and 2 steals. If you lost Darius Baisley to injury, pick up Aaron Wiggins or Alexei Pokazewski and slot one of them in for the rest of the season. 
Memphis Grizzlies' Jaron Jackson was ruled out of last night's game versus the Warriors with right thigh soreness. Kyle Anderson started in his place and posted 25 minutes, 13 points, 5 rebounds, and 1 assist. Jackson may come back on the 30th, but if he doesn't, Kyle Anderson should start again in his place. That concludes this episode. Thanks for watching and please come back again tomorrow morning, Wednesday, March 30th, 2022 and every day after that for the next Fantasy Basketball Daily Injury Report. If this video was helpful to you, please like, share, comment, subscribe, click on the notification bell and good luck winning your league.